In this video, we are going to talk about that one trick which all the pro graphic designers use in order to upscale their designs from this to this. So without further delay, let's drop the intro. Before starting this video, if you guys are new here, my name is Samrithu Das and I am a professional graphic designer, video editor and UI UX designer. In this channel, we talk about tips, tricks and tutorials regarding graphic design and video editing. So if you guys are into it, then consider subscribing to my channel. Also let's hope this video to reach at least 20 likes and I have given all the timestamps in the video description. So feel free to hop around the entire timeline. Alright, the main way to improve your graphic designs is to create depth. You may have seen many photographers and videographers are also saying the same thing that is to create depth in your photos and videos so that the subject pops out and that's why the photos and videos from the expensive gears looks so great. Because of the shallow depth of field the background is separated from the foreground and the subject pops out. Just like there are so many ways to create depth in your photograph like playing with the depth of field and playing with the shadows and highlights. There are many ways to create depth in your graphic designs as well. Number 1. Creating depth using storage allocation. You can allocate storage to different elements of your design so that the audience focuses on that particular part of the design. Like in this design, the artist used various boxes in the design to grab the audience's attention to that particular and important text. You can make these simple shapes by using the brush tool or the pen tool just as you like it and this will immediately make your designs 10 times better. Number 2. Creating depth using colors. So just as you expected, you can use colors to create depth in your graphic design. Deeper colors are more noticeable than the lighter colors. So you can allocate deeper colors to the portion of the design where you want your audience to focus on. And on the other hand, you can allocate lighter colors to the portion where you don't want your audience to focus immediately. Number 3. Creating depth using opacity. So this mainly works with text and abstract shapes but occasionally it can work with pictures as well. Just as you can see in this design you first notice the deeper text then you start focusing towards the lighter text. In this following design as you can see that there is something going on with the background as well but the immediate attention is getting drawn towards the deepest or the most contrasting element. Number 4. Creating depth using drop shadows. This is by far my favorite way to create depth in a design. With this effect you can actually add drop shadows to different layers of the particular design you are making and you can make the subject pop out from the background so that in return it will give a 3d effect to the viewers and this effect is way more versatile than the previous effects where you can actually change the direction of the drop shadow you can change the size the softness the blend mode and you can also add multiple drop shadows if you want as you can see in this ui design just by adding drop shadows in various layers and shapes such an amazing dynamic can be created in the whole ui so there you have it guys these are the four ways that you can use and implement in your design to make them attractive and eye-catchy immediately just remember the basic tip create depth so that's it for today guys hope you have enjoyed this video if you guys have any other suggestion or tips do mention them in the comment section below make sure to subscribe to my channel and turn on the bell icon so that you get notified whenever i upload a new video until then stay creative and i will hope to see you in my next video